Hey guys, Jeff Ford, Power Speed Endurance, back at you for another Two Minute Tuesday. This week was part three, breaking down why you should be taking your running outdoors. Week one, we talked about enjoyment. Week two, we broke down how the leveling and the terrain is going to be essential for you to actually train if your races are on the road. Your body needs to acclimate, acclimate to the bumps, the curves, and the upwards and downwards uh, side of running. Today we're gonna talk about why if you run on a treadmill all the time, this will actually inhibit uh, your ability to perfect the skill of running. Okay, It's gonna alter your biomechanics. Uh, two studies come to mind here. Number one, they did studies on aversion, excessive aversion of the ankles and internal rotation of the tibia on runners. The issue with this study is uh, where, what were these runners trained in actual run mechanics before the study? Obviously, if we've never been taught the skill of running, um, we've got to throw out studies that show uh, deviations from the standard that we've established. So that one wasn't quite as, as good, but it did show that using a treadmill, there was more rotation of the lower limbs uh, versus ground runners. The second study, which has a little bit more vali validity in my mind, uh, was on high level 10K runners. What they did is they had runners run on a treadmill at 103% of their 10K time trial pace, so faster than their body uh, typically runs on the ground. Uh, what they found is that as the distance went on in the treadmill compared, uh, running on the treadmill compared to running outside, they found that stride rate lengthened, okay, so their feet started to land outside of their general center of mass, which you know by uh, all the information we shared with you is not good, and also their cadence decreased, so their time spent uh, of, with their feet on the ground of the treadmill was more. We always want to make sure that we're spending as little time on the ground as possible, okay? Uh, so obviously you can tell the treadmill inhibited uh, their natural gait patterns that they would typically experience uh, in a 10K all-out effort. Um, so what this means for you is that you can't be uh, running on a treadmill all the time or it's gonna mess up your skill. The best comparison here is if you sit all the time, it's sort of gonna be that gradual effect. It's not the sitting for you know eight hours on day one that affects you, it's that sitting for 10 years, 15 years, 20 years, that then starts to wreak havoc on your hips, your lower back, and pains all around. Same deal is our perception of treadmills, is that if you always run on a treadmill, those slight variations that uh, difference in the in the mechanics of the treadmill doing some of the work for you is going to alter uh, your body over time and inhibit your movement. So uh, that's this week's tip on making sure to take your running outdoors. Uh, always look at the skill of running. Don't let anything inhibit it. My name is Jeff Ford, Power Speed Endurance. See you back next week.